Yo, what's up? This is Jinghan TV and you are watching uh, Season 3 of Lord of the Rings Rise to War Okay, so this time guys, uh, we're going to check ano yung, yung uh, new neutral units and that is our content for today so uh, let's get it on So let's check the mga bagong uh, neutral units. Okay, so let's start with the keeper. Okay, <clears throat> the keeper is located at Nan Lun Lun Lun. Okay, so dito siya naka locate na part sa bandang ayan, malapit ng Lindon and Arnor, so sa bandang taas niya and let's check yung kanyang stats okay isa siyang elf elf, she elf she elf enchanted weapon so ito yung kanyang mga skills inflict an additional 5% focus okay and then pounds when enemy has only one unit type keeper damage dealt plus 5% for one round ayan so that is the keeper and bababa lang yung cost nya no? 5000 sa wood 800 sa iron and 3,600 sa uh, grain 200, 2,500 yung kanyang gold <clears throat> cost okay so the perfect combination for this is uh, syempre you need to consider the location kung saan siya naka, nakalagay Okay, so, pag dyan yung kanyang location. Okay. Uh, Lindon has um, T4 range type. Okay, ganun din sa ganun din sa Arnor. And this one, Angmar has uh, T4 melee mounted special unit. Okay, so Ano bang magandang ipares? Ano dito sa ating keeper, dito sa keeper, what is the best fit for this? Uh, anong pinaka best na na combination, army combination, of course. Uh, give this she elf and uh, she uh, she uh, meat shield like cataprat uh, top of the line, Cataprat. And, goods din siya. Pag meron kang Ram Rider. Okay, inflicts an additional 5% focus damage. Aha. Uh -huh. um, she's perfect, I think, for farming. No, PvP wise. Uh, hindi. Hindi ito maganda sa PvP. Kasi, a lot of players are using uh, army combinations ano so sad to say ano this she elf is good for farming so that's it good for farming and the speed is 105 siege 5 farming talaga siya good for farming like uh, neutral camps or ito, pwede pala uh, you can use this one ano, you can use uh, keeper to uh, farm XP ano, you can use it to farm XP like uh, for I think Gandalf you can use Gandalf keeper and then uh, mag XP ka ng mag neutral XP ka sa Ents pero napakalayo ng Ents kaya mag 
tile kwan ka lang farm mga higher level tiles something like that pero may army composition din siya eh kaya goods lang to sa mga mm, farming farming ng neutral bases okay next uh, si fairer let's check this one si fairer Okay, ayan no, wow Nice one, who's this one? Okay, so yan no, nilalapitan na nila itong Seafarer Pero this is a T3 uh, Neutral unit like uh, Keeper T3 din siya And this one Seafarer melee Finesse Against damage from enemy commander Damage received, minus 3 Ang baba Ang kanyang race is Men Naval experience when battling on crossing damage dealt plus five percent. Mm -hmm. Check natin yung yung damage eighteen twenty one eighty five uh, forty three gagastos ka two two. Um, wala spice lang to. This is just a spice spice hindi siya. This is not a good commander, actually. The speed is 85. Very mabagal. Okay, kahit na sabihin mo nang big, ilag, ilagay mo to kay Ewen or yung mga magde-defend sa crossing, uh, hindi siya wise. Sorry, pero this is not I'm not happy with this. And even keeper, I'm not happy. I'm not happy with uh, the T3 new neutral unit keeper. Okay, so tinan natin kung ano yung worth it. Ano na mga new neutral units. Next is uh, rate. So let's check this. Okay, ang kan pala ang Location pala nitong Seafarer is sa part ng Gondor. Sa part ng Gondor yan. Okay. It's a race of men. Uh, siguro good to sa mga uh, rule play servers. Pero sa katulad namin na non-rule or mix rule. Mm, wala. Hindi, namin to, hindi mo yan gagamitin. Hindi mo yan magagamit sa PvP sa crossing crossing ano tapos meron pa siyang cost na 2200 na gold so mas magandang gumamit ka na lang ng Bree Rider instead of this Bree Rider is much better then si favor next one is rate let's go with this one rate okay ang rate ay matatagpuan sa part ng uh, huh? Arnor and in between of Arnor and Angmar. Okay, so karamihan ng makakagamit dito pag sa nan uh, <coughs> rule rule play is Arnor and Elves, the Lothlorien. And uh, yung yung tatlong yan. Lothlorien, Arnor, and Angmar. So, worth it ba ito? Let's check the stats. Check natin yung stats. So, this is undead. Take note of that undead. Okay, take note mo yung undead. And then, corrupting touch. On hit. Okay, napakaganda on hit. Basta may on hit. Positive to. Enemy units defense minus 1% can stack 5 times. Goods. Napaka goods nito. Next, prowl random melee units. Takes normal attack damage on rates behalf. No effect if no allied units remain. Random melee units takes normal attack damage on rates behalf. Oh. Next is yung perish all defeated units uh -huh, wounded units die after battle 
So the best part of this, the best skill is this one, the corrupting touch. On hit, mm -hmm. hey, take note nyo yan, ano. Next, 2, 3, damage, 80, uh, 23 to 24. Itong pro, random melee units takes normal da attack damage on reach behalf. No effect if no allied units remain. Okay, so if sa pagkakaintindi ko, Eh, basta yan. Ganyan na yan. Next one is... Ito. Ang, ang rate pala is... T3 unit lang siya. Next is... Vanguard. Okay. Uh, ito yung pinaka-awesome. Ano? Ito yung pinaka-awesome na... This is the... Mm, best part. Ano? Or best unit uh, new unit new unit new neutral unit so let's check ang uh, kanyang location pala is doon din sabi ko na nga ba eh, eh magandang ipares ito actually doon sa rate and then maglagay ka ng fallen pag ikaw ay ang mar ang mar pag ikaw ay ang mar vanguard t4 and then maglagay ka ulit ng t4 na fallen and then yung rate my goodness tapos gamitin mo si Theo din okay sa melee aha uh -huh. yes Theo din and witch king and high focus damage and high heal healing gandalf the grey gandalf the white power okay so let's check oh di ba undead siya pasahin nyo meron oh dito full armor physical damage received minus 1.5 Ito yung maganda, Undead Ally. This is the best skill for Vanguard. Undead Ally. When allied undead units are present, allied Vanguard are and undead units next hit damage dealt plus 10. Ah, uh, plus 3. Okay. So, ilan bang damage niya? 35 to 40. So, napakataas. Ano ng kanyang damage? Woo! Sarap nito guys pag um, mayroon kang Marshall ng Lothlurien. Ah, I mean Rohan. And then Wraith. And then Vanguard. Lupet. No, or Fallen na lang. Fallen na lang. Tsaka to, power na eh. So, that's it. That's it. The... Vanguard, Keeper, uh, Seafarer, and Wraith. So, the best new neutral unit is Vanguard. Vanguard. Okay, so that's it, guys. Uh, thank you for watching. And we will try you know, to make a video using uh, different neutral units. Okay, so that's it. This is Jingan TV, and if you want to subscribe to my channel, just click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell. So that's it. Goodbye.